Welcome to the Insta360 Flow Buttons tutorial. Flow has all the buttons you need to control the gimbal and phone fully. Here's how to use them. Let's take a look at the buttons on your Insta360 Flow. The Smart Wheel has all your key controls in one place for quick and easy access. The power button is at the bottom of the smart wheel. Long press to power your gimbal on or off. Press once to check the battery level. Press twice to enter sleep mode. You can exit sleep mode at any time by pressing any of the four buttons on the body of the gimbal. The shutter button is on the left hand side of the smart wheel. Press it once to take a photo or to start or stop recording. Long press to start burst shooting. The switch button is on the right hand side of the smart wheel. Press once to switch between the front and back cameras. Press twice to switch the phone between horizontal and vertical positions. Press three times to switch between video and photo mode. The joystick is in the center of the smart wheel. Pushing the joystick in any direction will control the gimbal. The zoom wheel is located on the outside edge of the smart wheel and can be used to zoom in and out. In auto, F and PF mode, rotate the wheel to the end and hold to continuously zoom in or out of footage. Rotate the wheel to the end and release to switch between lenses. The zoom feature is not available in the FPV mode. In this mode, rotating the zoom wheel will turn the roll axis clockwise or counterclockwise. The trigger button is on the opposite side of the smart wheel. Press once to start tracking. Press twice to recenter the gimbal. Press three times to flip the gimbal between forward and backward. Long press to enter lock mode. Press once and then long press to enter active plus mode. Touch panel. Swipe your finger clockwise or counterclockwise on the touch panel for half a circle to switch to the next mode. You can continuously swipe the touch panel to switch between modes. You can also double tap the switch button to switch to the mode on the right, or double tap the shutter button to switch to the mode on the left. The touch panel is the default method to switch modes. You can customize the default method in flow settings. You can choose between using the switch button and the shutter button, or swiping the touch panel to change the shooting mode. To reset Bluetooth, hold the trigger button and shutter button together for three seconds. You can also use the buttons to view your footage on the player page. Long press the switch button on the shooting page to enter the player page. Press the shutter button once to switch to the next file. Press the switch button once to switch to the previous file. Press the trigger button once to play or pause a video. Rotate the zoom wheel to zoom in or out of footage from the focus point. Swiping around the smart wheel can fast forward or rewind videos single press the power button to go back to the previous page. Thanks for watching the Insta360 Flow Buttons. Stay tuned for more tutorials and see you next time.